we go. Feeling better? If better is a euphemism for sober, then yes, I am feeling better. I wish I knew where Julia was. Mason, she probably stopped off to grab a bite to eat. She didn't have anything at the reception. She shouldn't be out in this rain. I know I'm supposed to drink this black, but I don't think it would kill me if I added a little sugar and cream. Okay, I'll get it. That you've done enough already. It may be hard to believe on a night like this, but there's still a few things I can do for myself and by myself without screwing up. Listen, um, I'm fine now, so uh, if you have plans for the rest of the evening... No, I really don't. I was just going to go home and read. Well, well, you go do it. It'd be a lot more interesting than sitting and watching me stare into my coffee cup, seeing my life flash before my eyes. Mason, you're not the first person that's ever been through this. You made a mistake. So, perfectly well-intentioned, decent human beings make mistakes. They stumble, they fall, they pick themselves up again. That's what you're going to do tomorrow. Tomorrow, you're going to choose to pick yourself up again and start over, one day at a time. Thank you. You're the first person today who hasn't made me feel doomed. I believe in you. Say that again. I believe in you. Now you may go. Are you sure you don't want me to stay? No, I'll, Just be, a... I'll, I'll be fine. I can barely hear you. It, no, it's the connection. It, Mrs. Cobb. Well, I, I thought we said... Oh, oh, oh. No, no, don't worry about it. Um, just give me a few minutes and, uh, and I'll, I'll pick some up. No, it, no, really, really, it's no problem. Uh, I hope your sister feels better soon. Thank you. Good night. Sarita. Hi, Mr. Castillo. How are you doing? Fine. I, I uh, didn't get a chance to say hello to you at the reception. I had to leave around the same time you did. Uh, Barr mentioned that he sent you over to that travel agency for him. Uh, it's a good thing they're open late, huh? Everything go all right? Yeah, it did. I, uh, well, you know what I did? I made the reservations for them tomorrow. They're going on this really gorgeous honeymoon. They're going to France and Italy and Spain. Oh, God, that's so great. Yeah. In that Isn't order? It? Yeah. Yeah, your friends, Italy, Spain. I, I think that's wonderful, I, but it, it did strike me as odd that he waited until today. I mean, I, I know if I were planning my own honeymoon, I would have taken care of it months ago. Yeah, I guess that's true, but, you know, if you've got that much money, I guess you don't really need to plan well, in advance. Isn't that the truth? I mean, he does have the bucks, doesn't he? Yeah. Well, it was good to see you again. Thanks. Good night. You take care. Can I have a club soda, please? Hey, is that you? Oh, hi. hi. I was hoping I wouldn't run into anyone I knew. What's wrong? Well, he must have left before the ritual humiliation. He staged another scene at the reception. It was so this time, but it did the job. He wasn't drinking, was he? He slid off the wagon a couple of days ago. How many times do you have to go through this? Enough to know that I shouldn't try to get him to go home when he doesn't want to go. They say some things get better with practice, and other things don't. And this is one of those other things. 
don't think I have the stomach for it anymore. I can't rise to the occasion. It's not your occasion to rise to, it's his. You can't make this into your problem. But it is. He's my husband, and we share the same house, and he's the father of my child. Has it occurred to you, you may have to ask him to leave that house and that child until I get straight? Again? Why does he always put me in this position? I'm sorry, Cal. I'm really sorry. I set myself up for this, you know? I say, you know, maybe if three months, if we get past three months, then he'll be home free. And then if we get past six months, then he'll really be home free. But it just doesn't stop. Well, he, he may yet wake up. Maybe. But for now, you're going to have to back away. You know that. I know. I'm sorry. It was strange not to see Eden there with you. Is everything okay? Uh, yeah. I hope so. Anyway, I've been trying to call her, but the phones are down. Uh, I guess I'm gonna run on home and check on her. Can I drop you somewhere? No, um, I've got my car. I, I'm just gonna stay here for a little while before I have to call. I'm okay. I'm really sorry. I know you are. You keep the faith, okay? All right. Call me if you need me. You need some company? 